Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Core Combat Chiang Mai, martial arts, fitness, MMA, self defense, kids kickboxing. Now available with 3 month, 6 month, and 12 month education visas. Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session. Core Combat Chiang Mai, martial arts for modern warriors. Alive or dead, it's your choice. ชื่นโพชั่นสปาร์คกิ้งวิตามินกับ 2
That's right, Fight Fans. Here we go, Ocean Fight Night. I'm Teddy Mulvick, along with Dana Bloomin here for the commentary as we're getting ready for an excellent, excellent display. A lot of amateurs on this card. We're going to see a lot of explosions. I think people really want to stand out, especially these two fighters here. Su Wana Akapunya versus Big Yen. Amateur boxing. We do have three rounds of three minutes each. Again, up-and-coming fighters on this card. We don't know a lot about them. Neither do you, but we will know a lot about them at the end of this fight when this bell rings in the final bell. As the fighters are making their way to the ring. Quite silent here, of course. Everyone knows not many people here now. We're trying to put on fights as well as we can for the world during this pandemic. We're doing our best. Su one on. All around fighter Su one on. Mostly Muay Thai, but now she's going to have her hands in amateur boxing. First time in the ring, I'm pretty sure, for Suwana. Big Yen, though, got power behind her right hand. Leads in with the left pretty well. Or throws an overhand right as well, so Suwana has got to be careful with that right. Teddy, I saw Suwana warming up outside earlier. She was throwing heavy on the mitts. I, I think she's going to bring some heat for Big Yen tonight. And she needs to. She needs to get respect for Big Yen. Big Yen's going to come in. I mean, she's called Big Yen for a reason. She's going to come in for some big money. Looks great right now. Tons of confidence. Absolutely. That's what I mean. I think, I think Sue and I needs to really round one first 30 to 40 seconds. She's got to establish something that Big Yen's going to take it. Got to get those jitters out. Opening up this portion. Again, I'm getting more right the same blue. You can follow me on Instagram. Teddy M U L V A G H. Hit me up. At Dana Blue and on Instagram, D-A-N-A-D-L-O-U-I-N. And you got that dope podcast, too, as Asian well. Asian MMA podcast, Bangkok Strange podcast, Dapper Villains podcast. I've got all the podcasts. <laughs> you basically have every <laughs> podcast in MMA and in, in, uh, in Asia. And there she is. Yeah. Sue enters the ring now. So she looks a little nervous, a little tentative. Relax, though. Looks relaxed. This is Ocean Park. Frederick's a great referee, very experienced. I've worked with him many shows. I do think that he's Wonderboy Thompson's uncle. That is not confirmed, but I I mean, conf how is he not? I, I think we can confirm it right now. <laughs> I don't need to see the DNA test. It's a fact. <laughs> I think I see a slight height advantage for Big Yen. I do not know the weights of these fighters here on this amateur They, they both weigh, I was at the weigh yesterday, they both made weight. Okay, here we go, round one, straight up boxing. Right three, to the middle. Three minute rounds from these two ladies. Let's do it. Look at Big Yen. Big Yen showing no fair. There, there's that right, goes down low. Good retaliation from Sue. Like that head movement early from Sue. She knows big punches can come. Pawing at each other now. Big Yen looks like she's just trying to get that range. There's that right. Connect, good head movement. Not enough though for Sue, but pretty good. Looking at her tight in there. Very static. There's that head movement. There she is now. I wonder if Big Yen's gonna overcommit. There it is. See? Ooh, there we go. Good punch to the body now. Nice one, two up top. Sue is not afraid to throw. She's getting in the pocket. Because you said the jitters when she walked in the ring seems to be out now. Yeah. Nice down to the body, back up top. Nice level changes from Big Yen. Big Yen keeps that left down, doesn't she? She's looking so relaxed. Yeah. She no, loves it in the ring. No respect for the power of Sue here. Now Sue stalking her now. Can she get her in the corner and get some work? Good left. Countered by Big Yen. Nice right there. Big, Big, Big Yen circles Yen. out. Intelligence there from Big Yen, my man Dana. Indeed. Intelligence. Indeed. Wow, she is really oh, confident. Right Big down Yen. the middle. Nice left off that. Good combination from Big Yen now. Look, so. Looks like Sue's getting a little bit of nervous, closing her eyes when she's throwing punches now. Big Yen throwing right down the middle when she connects. Beautiful. Just like that. One, two, can't do good. Good distance now from Big Yen. Confidence on the rise, as if it wasn't already high <laughs> right? as she walked in. <laughs> oh, it, Throwing combinations. 
Now I feel like Sue's just chasing and throwing now. And I don't mind. I mean, big risk, big reward, Dana. But yeah. the thing is that if she's going to run in, she's going to get hit with something, and it's going to be intensified. So she's got to be careful. She, her head's a little bit too static for that yeah. approach. Try and change levels. Look at the measuring now from Big Yen. Big right hand down to the body now from Sue. So accurate. Oh, oh with that right hook. And another one. Well, Sue firing back, though. Sue taking some punches now, taking it pretty well. I don't see too much markings on the face. Got those big gloves. What I'm worried about here is Sue could be too excited in the first round, this being her first boxing match, that she just gets tired out yeah. from the excitement. The adrenaline dump, absolutely. Good left. 30 seconds left. We have to see how she comes out in that next round. Measuring now. Yeah, and so composed. She's got so many weapons, that's what she's doing now. She's just kind of calculating which one does she want to throw. A lot of them is landing, a lot of them are getting uh, scoring points in the highs of the judges here. Catching her with that jab right in the middle every time. Down the mass pipe, yes sir. We are in the belly of the beast. Bangkok, Thailand, no better place Ten for seconds. sports. There we go. Oh, no, 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 Oh man, that's, oh. that's that first fight jitter, oh, yeah. isn't it, Dana? She's smiling, look, she's laughing yeah. at herself. That's yeah. oh. Whoa. Not a bad first round. Active round yeah. one from both fighters. Now, I want to see, I'm curious to see how Sue comes out in the second round. She gets that adrenaline dump now, and she's just shot. Well, oh, she's not sitting. She's standing up between rounds, both of them. Both of them are standing up between rounds. You got to love the, uh, both of them are, um, what do I want to say, the stamina is there, trained on the way in. Look how composed Big Yen is in that corner. Yeah, 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 coach, yeah, coach. Yeah. Yeah, coach. Look at Sue. Sue's a little bit tentative here. Yeah, right. Looking away. I like to see her eyes on, the, on yeah. her trainer there. Yeah. Big Yen just, just chilling. Yeah. Just chilling yeah. in the yeah. corner. Yeah. She's like, yeah. Yeah. Big smile yeah. there as well. All right. Well, this is over soon. Lunch. What are yeah. we doing? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Get some sum tum. Yeah. I mean, has she broke a sweat? Doesn't no, it doesn't even look like it. Yeah. No. I mean, Big Yen took the first round. I think we both easily, say easily. There. Yep, that second. jab is her. She, she's almost 100% connecting with that yeah. jab in that first round. And it's really opening up everything that she has. Yeah. I want to see movement from, from Sue here. I want to see left and right movements sort of get out of the way. Because yeah. like, she's coming down the pike. Yeah. Circle out. Don't just go back and forward. Ooh, that was ugly. That, that first jab from Sue. Again, that jab from Big Yen. Mm. Oh, oh, to the body. Oh, my. She's slugging now. She's trying to put her away in her own in corner. corner. She is. Yep. Beautiful uppercut there. Lance follows it with a left. These two girls are banging. Taking her time. Begins so You can see the experience. She's just yeah. not rushing in here. That jab again. And Not then she's setting up that right hook with the jab every time. And if Sue, if Sue does... Go up for defense, no problem. Big Yen's gonna dig it down low. Yeah. Now Sue, trying to put some power behind those gloves. Let's go. I love that Sue's stepping in now. See if she's keeping her eyes. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Oh. Down to the body. Oh, they come back out. Sue throws that left just as a, as a last second ditch to try and get Big Yen out of the way. It's working. Big Yen's giving her God, another one. Jab is the tap. I mean, it's what, it's what the fight is. Yeah. I, I, Sue needs to follow up when she steps in like that. She's got to make it worth it. Big body oh. shot from Yen. Followed up with a nice one two up top. Perfect range. She was so crisp at the connection point. Redness now on Sue's face. So you can see the damage. Sue's keeping her chin a bit high here, too. I'm getting worried. Good call, man. Right to the body back up top. Oh. Against footwork, man. Her footwork is really nice. She's moving great. She's avoiding shots off. Yeah. Sue's tentative. She's, she's getting nervous. Back up against the ropes. Oh, 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 down the oh. body. Begin lets her out. Let's see if Sue can mount some offense here. Come on. Begin completely in control here. Right oh. down the pike of one, two. Follows it up again with another. Zero respect for the stand up of Sue here by Big Yen. Good. Nice, nice slip. Yep, yep. She needs a lot more of that. A bit more offense. A lot less of that. <laughs> <laughs> Measuring now, Big Yen. Sue gets out of the way. Big Yen's not even keep, she's keeping her hands at her hips here. Doesn't even care. 
Side note, both just wearing regular trainers <laughs> yeah. ring right now. It's just kind of weird. Is Sue wearing feelers? Oh, 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 the body! Oh, oh. she wearing feelers? Yes, yeah, she is. Got her the body almost folded, Sue! The warrior spirit, though, and then we got 10 seconds. Those to body down. shots. I see, I see a lot more power coming from Big Yen here in round two. Absolutely. She's mm, stepped to the oh, right. Good job, my no. lord. Wow, what a oh, round for Big Yen. What a round for Big Yen. Again, just back. I don't even think she's sweating. Back in the corner, chilling, just relaxing. The jab is the weapon here that's opening everything up everything. for Big Yen. And you see it. You see the redness of the face there. Eyes are starting to swell up. Sue needs to, if she's going to rush in to take a shot, she needs to make it worth that attack and start to follow up. We're not seeing that. And you can see it in her face. She's paying the price. Yeah. I mean, hopefully she will learn a lot from this fight. I don't see anything. I don't see a haymaker coming from her here. No. I think Big Gen's just going to take it. But let's see if she can evolve in round three. Mm -hmm. I like to see fighters do that during the fight. Absolutely. I mean, I'm not sure in her first fight we're going to see that, but I would really like to see some sort of an evolution here, some sort of learning from round one and two. Based on the way that Big Yen just turned it up between rounds one and two, how is she going to come out in round three? It seems like her power has been picking it up here. So the third round. Third and final round. Once again, Suwana in the blue. Big Yen in the red. Big Yen in the, in the black trunks. Su Wana in the pink. Big Yen stalking quite a bit more early on here. I mean, is she going to try and just put her away? Is she going to be nice and just take the victory? Or is she going to try and punish her? She got her in the, in the oh. ropes now against the ropes. Oh, and again with the jab, Dana. Come right down on. the middle. Big Yen likes to push her to the edge and then gives her a little bit of room to come back. Yeah. Falls it up with the right. My Dang, oh. left by Sue. There you go. Sue grabbing, grabbing there. A little bit of grapple. Sue right in front of her trainer here. Let's see if she can take this information and do something with it. I, I feel like she's only landing like 10% of her shots. Yeah. I mean, she might be have eyes closed as well. She's yeah, you see, she steps yeah. in and she closes her eyes. Missed that right, though, but I like it. Come on, high risk, high reward. Let's go. Let those gloves fly, Sue. This is the thing, Teddy. We know that jab, and Sue knows this jab is coming every time she steps in and she just keeps stepping into it i mean why not like you said what is she at a 99 percent accuracy right there down low now from sue good cover up on the way out big big yen's understanding of range in this fight is so impressive she's keeping sue at the end of that range the whole time just snapping that Chris jab into her face. She was just confident when she walked up to the back. Oh, to there the body. Is. There's that left again, falls over oh, the right. Bringing some volume. Big Sue's in trouble. Oh, Sue's throwing back. Out these two modern day warriors trying to fight it out. Oh, there's that oh. All day. Emphasized by the ponytail, the slap of the ponytail on the back as well. Redness all over Sue's face now. Big Yen just looking for those shots. And, and she can just take and pick whichever she wants. It is all open now. A minute left here. Big Yen. Oh, oh, right here. Here. I mean, still hasn't broken a sweat as she can. Yeah, she looks great. And look at the footwork. And she said before. Really just moving yeah. well. To Sue's credit, she is still coming forward. Yes. She's still in there. Warrior's heart as well. Yes. We will see a lot more of Suwana Acapunya for sure. But right now, oh God, Ooh. vicious jab again. I, I think with Sue, a few more, a few more months, a little yeah. bit more sparring, she, yeah. she will look good. She will look Absolutely. better. Maybe some new shoes. <laughs> Maybe some new Pumas. <laughs> she's not looking. She's not looking bad. Uh, like, she looks. Oh, and another jab there. Great combination. Hell of again. a chin. Hell of a chin. Look at her. Is that an uppercut coming? What is she trying to do? Something. Big Yen just plotting. 15 seconds left now in the third and final round of the opening bout potion fight night. Thanks for joining us worldwide on the stream. So oh, taking my. some punishment against the ropes. Swing and a miss from this girl now. Haymaker to the body. Swing and a miss again. Not Big the Yen. Wow, that is it, everyone. Third and final round. What a, what a round. I think it's very easy to set. Very easy, Teddy, to say for me that Big Yen is taking that on all three judges' yeah, scorecards. Uh, absolutely. Ten, nine rounds each way. Warrior's heart from Sue, though. Again, see the devastation on yeah, her face. Barely a sweat broken on Big Yen. Sure. Big Yen looked great. I would really like to see her, obviously, against 
uh, some competition that can really bring it to her. Because yeah. I think uh, I think she has a lot of things in her, a lot of weapons in her arsenal. I think here she went with what worked. But uh, I'd like I, to see both these fighters again. I really like Big Yen's ability to sort of back soon to a corner, then back away a little bit to get her to chase her down. Because she knew that she was just going to keep coming forward. And then throw that jab. Right down the middle. Oh, look at Sue's face. That is... No surprise there, folks. No surprise at all. Good job. Congratulations. Ton of respect between the fighters. Sue's all smiles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, true, true fighter. True fighter spirit from her. Swollen cheeks and eyes. Big smile. Ear to ear. This might be the most interesting names on the card coming up, to Teddy. The real Slim Shady versus... Core Combat Chiang Mai. Martial Arts. Fitness. MMA. Self-Defense. Kids Kickboxing. Now available with three months, six months and 12-month education visas. Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session. Core Combat Chiang Mai. Martial Arts for Modern Warriors. ชื่นโพชั่นสปาร์คกิ้งวิตามินกับ 2 รสชาติใหม่ศูนย์แคลไม่มีน้ำตาล
ดื่มอร่อยเอนจอยกับชีวิตได้ทุกวันหาซื้อได้แล้ววันนี้ Drink Your Potion Comeback kid. I'm not sure that is the name I would want as a fighter. Yeah, he he must have had a couple comebacks and then they gave it to him, right? Yeah, he's been down. Some good knockout. Power. Okay. We were just being informed by John Nutt that there was a corner shift. Yeah, that's what that that was my little hiccup there. I really hope round one's not 11 minutes. Yeah, that would be rough. Yeah, old pride rules. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Ten minute first down. round. Nah, we got three three minute rounds here. MMA. Now there's going to be no knees, no elbows, and there's going to be no leg locks. So these are I'm IMAF round. rules. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. No 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 leg locks. Uh, you can only do a a straight Achilles lock under the IMAF rule set. No heel hooks. Nothing twisting. Not sure we're going to see any of that here on their repertoire. These guys are uh, very, uh, very green in the MMA world. I think they just came here to bang. I, exactly. <laughs> Again, fight fans, switch the red and black. Red and blue, blue, sorry. Guys look ready to fight. Kristoff, much taller, seems a lot wider as well on the shoulders, so he definitely has an advantage there as far as size wise as you can see right now. Quite a okay. quite a height advantage, which would generally translate to a reach advantage. I do not think this is going three rounds. I got a feeling my man Dana I, that this is gonna end swiftly. I feel it in me man bits. I, I agree with you. Second fight on this card. Potion fight night again. I'm Teddy Mulvey alongside Dana Bluing. Thanks for joining us worldwide. In the belly of the beast. Bangkok time. Oh, oh right with the haymaker. Down. Kick to the body. Head down. Eyes closed as well. Big left. Oh, oh, that's that's going going he's landing his way. They don't even care. Oh, Here we go. go. Come back, kid. He's smashing him. Knee to the body. Oh, a little bit. Oh, oh. the knee there. What a start. What a start. Okay, now they're. Oh, beautiful! Black. The comeback kid doesn't care. He just puts his head down and throws. Black and red for Corey. Kristoff in the all black shorts. Kristoff staying composed. Ooh. As a German sniper, he definitely has been in more situations here, so he should be very composed. Cool under pressure. Wow. 
Let's see if the adrenaline goes. Oh, oh, oh. And he lands again. And he ate it. He ate it. Okay, yeah, he's, he is tired. Yeah, Mouth Corey. open now. Corey may have thought this would last. Oh, he's busted. Yeah. I don't remember what shot actually busted that nose up. He's gassed, though. He's not yeah, feeling he it. He let it. He wanted that early win. He heard us talking. Yeah. Knees straight up the middle. Good uppercuts as well. Dirty boxing by Kristoff. Going for that standing guillotine. Is he going to get it? Oh, is he going to get it? He's going to get it. Small. He's calling it. Yeah, get him. Calling it. How tired he is. Losing his height advantage. He oh, is he out? He's out. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What a finish. 129 left in round one. And Corey, the comeback kid, is done. Great save by the referee, realizing that he was outstanding. Yeah. Yep. What a great, great save by the ref. And we talked about the height advantage. Definitely used to his advantage here Ooh. with that standing guillotine. Kristoff weathers the storm, which was a hurricane coming out of him. Gale Force winds coming out of him yes. right from the beginning. What a chin on this guy, too. We yep. saw a couple thunderous left hands. Land flush. Flush, my man, Dana. What a... Beautiful. No comeback for Corey today. Not today. Wow, great fight. Yeah, it I didn't came out of nowhere. You yeah. just bleed it all. Some really good dirty boxing, great knees from Kristoff. Absolutely. To finish that off. Energy. A zero carry energy drink full of vitamin B, taurin, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Jordan, oh, I believe. Okay. His curry puffs are probably very popular there. That makes a lot more sense. Tango is an excellent pastry chef. <laughs> I mean, absolutely delicious. But you know, it's a scary right hand. But I've said before, the scariest thing about Tango is onset diabetes. <laughs> but his right hand is vicious. 
So he missed weigh-ins because no one cares for his the way he weighs. But he told me he's 130. He's definitely not 130. <laughs> he was 130 in high school. 130 kilos. Yeah, 130 by the way. kilos. This is in kilos, folks. Tang Moon, absolute legend in the Bangkok fight scene. Absolutely. Oh, he almost tripped the other day. Uh, Tangmo is known as the guy who will take any fight, any time. Doesn't matter how small the opponent is, how big. Clearly. Very famously known for knocking out uh, Tyson DeWeese, very racist cop from America. Yep. Laying him out in about 30 yeah. seconds. I believe that's Tangmo's only win. It's the only one I saw. But that's the only one he needs. Yeah. As far as I'm concerned. He's a legend in his own right. Take yeah. this on short notice, by yeah. the way. As he does every fight. You can always call him. <laughs> You call Tango, he'll drop what he's cooking and make it to the ring. Uh, no lie, I went outside uh, just to get some fresh air. Tango was smoking a cigarette. <laughs> I'm not joking. He no, I saw him smoking a cigarette. Outside. Yeah. I go, when you fight, he's like, third fight. <laughs> Blowing out cigarettes. Well, it look, that looks good in the ring. Yeah, there's a little man booby going on, but you know, not I bad. Mean, they both have gorgeous <laughs> nipples. <laughs> both of them. <laughs> He's a big boy. Now, Matt did make weigh-in, and he was 98 kilos at weigh-in. There he is. Now, I often wonder, did, is Tangmo the nickname that his parents gave him when he was born, or did he grow into earning that? Either way. Usually, though, when they're... When they're So for those of you guys who do not know, Trinity rule set, first round boxing, second round Muay Thai, third round MMA. We are not going to see the MMA round. I don't think uh, we're going to see the kickboxing round. Really? I'll be honest. Yeah, I'm definitely. Sure. I'm going to be honest. I think, I think it's a 30 second fight. Tang yeah. Tango is dangerous for about 30 seconds. Yes. Uh, he was a no moss in his, uh, in his debut at uh, Fight Circus. Yeah. A little head kick. Yeah, in his second fight, he got submitted. Uh, yeah, here we go. By, by a, a light one. Tang Mo. Go, Nat's coming in strong now. Oh, uh, Haymaker's now Tang Mo. Uh, Tang Mo's pockets oh, turned out. Oh, did he? Uh, wait, is, is this a timeout? Is this a timeout? I think, yeah, it's maybe a little. Wow, Nat is ready. Yeah, he is. Ready. He's focused. He's focused. Oh, it's a little bit of an eye poke. Maybe. Okay, maybe. You should push Tangle's pockets back in. Here we got them hanging out. <laughs> oh my god. Nice job there now, Tangle. Great the job. Nat is looking for him. Tangle backpedaling. Now trying to work that jab. There oh, Tangle. Oh, oh what, what's going on here? Tangle, come on, buddy. Come on, Tangle. What's up? This is boxing rules, right? So they, they have to take a little break. Tangmo patting the belly. Here we go. Big oh, right hand swinging this. Slipped it. Nice. That's about power. That yeah. right hand. He knows he's trying to measure with that jab. Really good, good right. Good head move from Tangmo. I got to admit. Oh, big right oh, hand. Big knockdown. Hand. Down. This boxing is boxing. Rules. Yep. Boxing rules. Get back up. Tangmo looks a little rocked. That big right hand from that. Really connected strong in the opening of this bout. We got. Oh, Tango turns! Oh, to the body! Oh, Fight's right, over! That's it, that's it, that's it. Great job by Matt! That's it. Matt was throwing heavy. Yeah. Now, we, we predicted a finish in the Tango fight. Oh. You said 30 seconds. <laughs> you, said, you said 30 seconds, it was just oh. over a minute. <clears throat> I mean, he had the three breaks during the fight. That's true. So you're right, it's about 30 <laughs> seconds of action, Dana. That's why you get paid the big bucks. Good Matt. call. Nat coming in vicious, coming in hot. Tango looks like he might be having some air issues. We had a game plan. He stuck to it. Come out aggressive. Come he brought out the heat. He yep. brought the heat. Yep. Again, though, Tangmo willing to take any fight at any time. 
against anyone. And continues his Tango continues his streak of losing to smaller opponents, but that's fine. And, and also first round yeah. streak as well, which is a. Uh, but let's be honest. Does anyone want to see Tango in the second round? I like him in the first. Round. I'm not saying cardio is an issue, but I don't want to find out. I know. I want to know that he's he's leaving now to go for a smoke and a curry puff. He will go have a cigarette right now. Probably a beer. Wow. John not killing it in the ring. Stay tuned. Jody McLaren. Potion energy. A zero carry energy drink. Full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink. Core Combat Chiang Mai, Martial Arts, Fitness, MMA, Self-Defense, Kids Kickboxing. Now available with 3-month, 6-month and 12-month education visas. Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session. Core Combat Chiang Mai, Martial Arts for Modern Warriors. Teddy, this looks like it is going to be a good fight. <laughs> Teen MMA. Yeah. Little kids punching each other. I'm all about it. I think I've typed that into Pornhub a couple times, but uh, this is my first time seeing it live. So this kid right here, Tobin McLaren, out of Ireland. This is his debut here in MMA. It is actually his debut anywhere. This is his first fight for this kid. 
I would have never guessed the guy with the name Tobin was from Ireland. <laughs> with a Mick in his name as well. Yeah, yeah. No, no, yeah. no inclinations of that at all. Rocking a beautiful farmer's tan on yeah. the way into the ring. A little bit of a red t- tinge in that hair as well. <laughs> good super Irish. Yeah. Freckles, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like he's 12. But if I know anything from my literally looks. Compare the time that. So the color balance is not off. The image is not overexposed. That is actual skin color. Skin color. But Irish kids can crack, man. I mean, he seemed serious on the way out when I was talking to him before the fight. You know, he wasn't really taking it too lightly. He's taking it seriously. Hopefully, you know, he's thinking he's got a future here. He's got Tommy Hayden in his corner, which yeah. is good to see. Former UFC fighter, champion in his own right. Former FMD, FMD champion. Yeah, absolutely, he's won a sword. I believe, <laughs> I believe he was the first FMD champion crowned. Oh, okay. If I'm not mistaken. Were you ref? And you were a ref back then. I was a ref back then. That's his opponent, the young Gunner. Gun is his name. That's right. I'm not going to mess with that last name. I'm just going to keep him as Gun. Gun, gun to not. I find it hard to believe that Tobin is 15 years old. He's not a day over 11. Nice. Looks all of 12 and a half. Well, you will notice they are wearing shin pads for this fight, and that is the IMAP amateur rules that they have to wear shin pads as teenagers. This guy is tied, Gun is tied, and he's 17. That probably means he only has 300 fights to his name. Ruffin Yorkie M in there. His trainer dips. Rocky with that pinstripe uh, spark coat. Rocky has been dropping freestyles all day. (laughs) Soon. Two minute rounds, Team MMA Amateur, rising stars here. We got Ireland against Thailand, Nick Chapman in the ring, looking like a beast. <laughs> Especially against <laughs> these two. <laughs> yeah. Nick Chapman looking like, <laughs> looking like the, <laughs> uncle, the uncle at the cookout <laughs> about to have a uh, fight between his two nephews. He's a big dude in general, but you see him next to these guys. Again, we're joking here, and we're making light of it again, but these guys are serious as can be. Are we going to two minute rounds? We see a five minute here. I believe these are. There we go. 15 against the gun. Right in with a takedown. Right away. Can he do it? Tries to dump him in here. Secures it in the corner. Careful, his head's out of the ring. Are they going to slide him in? Is he going for a submission right now? He might From the bottom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Slide him in. So Good job. The, this is what I don't like about the ring with MMA is you end up with these situations. No, 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 I, no, I would keep much on the prefer the, the cage. Sorry. Nick's right. putting right. him back. Yeah. This is not Nick's first rodeo. He knows what's up. We got, this is what we got to work with. He puts him inside. He puts him in a half guard here. Yeah. Good movement for the 15-year-old. And he's sliding out now. He's got a butterfly in there, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Nice left hand. Can he's he kick that out? He kicks it out. Let's see. He's got that right arm trapped. I mean, this kid's been trained. It's yeah. 15 years old. I like what I see here. Nice defensive posture yeah. on the bottom. Well, going for he's, he's trying to set up that arm. Well, and Gun stands out of it. Is he going to let him up? He's not letting him up. This is that amateur experience here. They just they don't really know what to do in this position. Oh, good oh. kick. Good up kick. Illegal in high mouth rules. Oh, you even from this position, you cannot kick cannot to the up kick to the head from IMAP rules. Chapman lets it go. Wasn't a vicious kick. It also didn't look intentional. He's just wet. To- Toby's just wailing the legs out there. Nick Lerman's still on the ground now. Trying to oh, pass the guard and he does. It's a side mark. So he's using up the knee in there. Yeah. He's getting back to guard. I love what I see from this 15 year old here, man. <laughs> Absolutely. You can tell he's well trained. Uh, and now he's back up. He's got the neck. Come on. He's got the neck. Lock no, it. Gun's out. And now we're back up to our feet. 
Morgan Gun in the black and yellow. We've got Toby in the black. Let's see how their energy is after that first little ground exchange. Though. They might, you know, that big adrenaline jump, first time fighting. Tries to take him down. We see where Gun wants this fight to be. Keep going. Oh, they're a little confused there. Gotta hear the horn, fellas. Go into the horn. Good job. Nice. Good job. Good job. Very active first round. Super active first round. Good defense by Toby. Of course, Gun takes the round. Took yes, down absolutely. A couple times. Went for, uh, I'll tell you what I saw from Tobin, though. Very composed on the ground, under pressure. Taking shots. Took up a very defensive posture. Was able to you know, get back up. And he, he, he was even threatening. You know, I think you gotta you got to play it out there, right? Do you want to burn your arms out trying to choke this guy? Or do you want to get back to a position where you can do some damage? So this is two two-minute rounds. If it is a tie, they will go to sudden victory. So if if, um, if Toby takes this next round, we will see an exciting round three, which is cool. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'll watch more of this all day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Much different than the first two fights. Yeah, you know, this might be the most skilled. Uh, I have to say, maybe not the most skilled because Big Yen was quite skilled in there, but uh, overall, this is got a great fight here for Potion Fight Night. Looks like Gunn is having some issues with his uh, shin pad. So, oh, Nick missed it. He didn't fix it. Here we go. A lot of nervous energy from Tobin. Yeah. Angsty teens in the ring. Right Back for the takedown. Secures it quite easily. Yeah. Toby's got that post up, but he can't do it. He can't get up. Now he's going to try and work from down low. Good punch up top. Good defense again from Toby. I want to see some offense, though, from yeah. the Irish kid. Watch that right hand. Oh, can't uh, another illegal up kick. Oh, good oh. hammer fists. Oh, he's got his back on his opponent. You want to see that? Gun in control now. Okay. Toby just needs a little bit of offense. He's very comfortable on his back. He just needs to be able to attack a bit more to, to get some points on the cards here. Good defense here. He knew it was coming. He kind of sat into that. Now he's hanging on to the neck. He's squeezing it. Oh, he's going to pop out. Yeah, yeah, he's got it. Watch these rights and lefts now. Oh, oh full oh, out! Oh, no! He needs to strip and control the hips. Yeah. Oh, he's going to try and go out the back door. No, he's... Uh oh uh -oh. Nick Chapman is taking a close look at this. Gunn is just raining down punches yep. while he can. Not yeah, much power, but they are connecting. It's volume. Oy. Keep in mind, this is amateur. Nick Chapman has no choice but to step in and stop it here. I'm at rules. Yep. And, and Gunn lost his shin pad. Where the hell but, did his shin pad go? <laughs> it's over there, the, the other side of the ring. Oh, you, you know what? It was when he slipped. When he slipped in the full yeah. mount, so that came out. Here's the thing with that stoppage, right? So, this is IMAP rules. These are kids. You need to err on the side of caution. Even though those punches aren't doing a ton of damage, Nick was keeping a very close eye on that, and he he stopped it at the perfect time before yeah. any real damage did happen. And there wasn't much defense there. I mean, he was trying to shrimp, but kind of like under. He actually, was not shrimping. He was trying to go out the back door. It wasn't working. Uh, punches raining down on him, a couple unanswered punches, yeah. probably seven to eight unanswered punches. So yeah, Nick Chapman steps in. Perfect. We'll see, we'll see this kid again though. At one point, Tobin even tried to turn away and Gun hit him right back on his back. Very dominant performance by Gun. Head hanging low from the boy from Ireland, which it should not be at just 15. Yeah. A Off great fight. fight night card here. Ladies and gentlemen, here with Again, no losers at the event. This is Team MMA for someone that's 15 years old. That doesn't mean read when you're 15 years old. It's hard. John, not with the knowledge. Go with it. Go Great fight by both of these guys. Really no losers in this fight. At this age, amateur. They're, they're just gaining experience, putting it in the bank to put it to work later.
Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Core Combat Chiang Mai Martial Arts Fitness MMA Self-Defense Kids Kickboxing Now available with 3-month, 6-month and 12-month education visas Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session Core Combat Chiang Mai Martial Arts for Modern Warriors Named after a smoked nice. meat, it might have Kobas is the best one. <laughs> I, I'll be honest. His back could be a rock. Yeah, wall. like people climb on that. Plenty Let's of grips see. there. Not mm, shred city as well. Yeah. Again, maybe more cardio than time. Someone just. Someone was asking us what the weight class is. Chris no from idea. retired working for you asked what the weight class was. But it doesn't matter. They both made weight. Thirty-five maybe? Maybe. Actually so Naeem missed weight a bit yesterday. He had an hour to make weight. Yeah, no, no, me. me. Had an hour to make weight. Goes out to the parking garage at the mall, covers himself in trash bags, and starts running to the point where he can no longer move. 
running barefoot in a parking garage to cut weight, weighs in, he's underweight, he's just like 300 grams more than he needs to. And I remember Chris from a retired work for you asked Rocky, how much weight did he lose? And Rocky says, all the grams. <laughs> so he lost all the grams. And now we see him here in this beautiful underground ocean fight night. Stay tuned, main event, the ladies fighting for a championship. Marie versus Poe, that is going to be a skill fest, but for the here and now, Colton in the blue, in the red. And both these guys. Okay, so Trinity fights, only boxing, only boxing right here. Colton with a lot of energy. Oh, oh. Right hand! Goes for it again. Right hand answers by Naeem. Nice! Naeem has that range oh. figured out quick. Nice uppercut from Naeem on the inside. Oh! Doubles up on that jab now, Colton. Seven ounce gloves for the Trinity fights. Oh, good comedy. Nice. She got him against the ropes. Oh! Oh! Nice movement oh. there from Colton. Colton feeling a little bit more relaxed now as the seconds are ticking away here. Round one. Ooh, watch the head. Might see some headbutts here. It looks like Naeem oh. caught Colton with something there. Big right hand. Falls up with a left. Connects with another left. Colton slips out. Teddy, I will tell you, Naeem is definitely landing a lot yeah. more, but when Colton lands, it definitely lands. Power from the Chicago native. Oh, good left hand, though. Big oh. right. Another left hand. What a chin. Colton looks like he's rocked. Bangkok rolling now. Dirty boxing. Tries to throw him around. Good clinch here. Oh, get ready, Colton. Get ready, Colton. There we go. Naeem moving forward, really putting the pressure on Colton. Naeem looks confident. Yeah, super confident. Colton clearly the more muscular of the two fighters. Naeem not caring. The traded punches! Naeem says let's go! What an exciting round one here. Good left by Colton. Naeem walked right into that. One, two, slightly misses. Naeem on his way in. He's got to watch that head on the way in. He just ducks down. Yeah, see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's getting a bit Frederick dangerous. giving them a warning. Yep. Beautiful round one now. 48 seconds left. Big left. Doesn't do it. Nice Naeem's pouring it on! So many miss from Colton. Naeem got some good combinations on the inside. Standing and banging now, both fighters. U.S. versus Thai here, pushing fight night. 30 seconds now. Are they going to calm it down? Or are we going to see a nice barrage that we saw before? These rounds go by so quick. <laughs> nice luck. Power from Colton in every punch. Oh right. my god! Naeem slams another right! What a chin! Naeem just shakes it off! Colton oh. switching stances and has no problem throwing from traditional or southpaw. And I don't think it matters him. He looks so well versed. Hell of a first two minutes. Oh, oh Colton's cup. It's pouring out of his head here. Pouring out of his oh, head. Jesus, that may have been a headbutt, yeah? Yeah, it looks like it. I don't think a punch was. Wow, he's they're, they're calling medical. City right now. They're just spewing out there. See, this is where, a, uh, this is where a, uh, a replay would really be lovely. Yeah, medical staff on hand, though. They're going to take care of that, try to get that stopped. It doesn't look like it's in a bad spot. Yeah, it, at least for stand up. Yeah. So I think they're pro if they can get it to stop, they're going to let this keep going. Oh, please let this keep going because we are about to enter round two. And on Trinity, we know that right now we're going to enter the end. We are a Muay Thai round. We're going to see some kicks, some knees. Some knees. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. These two guys have got power. You know, Naeem, if he gets in the clinch. His ability to control the range just perfectly is fantastic. And he was taking shots like a champ. And Colton's not throwing, he's not throwing light shots. Ill intentions behind the rights and lefts that Colton was throwing. Looks Come like, on, stop it. 
stop that seepage. Okay, that is a war wound. Not even a cut. My lord. Let's see if they're putting pressure on. Let's see when they pull that away. Oh, come on, Frederick. <laughs> right in our way. Frederick's taking a look at it. Frederick's wiping him down. That's a good sign. He's getting him dry. It's ultimately the doctor's decision at this point, or is it Frederick's decision? The, the doctor will make the decision at this point, but Frederick seems to think that it's going to keep going, the way he's wiping him down, getting him dry. VP initially in there as well, put on this whole show. Congrats to him. Such a hard time to get up. Oh, no! That is so... Oh, my God, though. Look at how much blood is in there. That, that is so upsetting. Damn. That is so upsetting because we were, this was a fantastic fight. Ref stoppage after round one. Don't, I don't know how that happened. I honestly, I think it's a headbutt. Oh yeah, because we see a cut. Yeah. We see a cut just above the left eye. I mean. Yeah. You're talking about Nick Lee though. One of the sexiest promoters in ah, Asian MMA. Hands down. Yeah. John Mount with the knowledge. I, I am so upset by yeah. that. Right, look how much, that's just sticking to his head with nothing holding it there. Okay, so you gotta think about that. Wow. Hey, great show for both guys, but. I was right about to say that. Now he, now he, now he looked very good, took a couple shots. Had great combinations on the inside. I would have loved to see him in Muay Thai, especially in MMA as well oh in round three. I would have loved to see the kicks come into play. So upsetting, so upsetting. But as John Nutt said, this is a contact sport. These things do happen. Energy, a zero carry energy drink full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion.
from around the globe here in Bangkok, Thailand. PFM would like to let everybody know the last matchup has been reviewed and it will be ruled a no contest due to that accidental headbutt. But more action is on the way, ladies and gentlemen, and that is MMA Mixed Martial Arts Professional 5. Three five-minute rounds of pro MMA. Let's first bring out our blue corner. Making his way to the ring, Jack Ferguson. Got pro MMA rules here. Five minute rounds, three five minute rounds. Unified rules. Pro unified. So no no knees to the head on the ground, no soccer kicks, and no uh, 12 to 6 elbows. All unfortunate things to me. Yeah. I, I like the FMD rule set. Just, what is it, like an old style pride? So it's pride with elbows. That's awesome. I love it. John Lett knows what's up. Maroc Force MMA. Thank for Jack. Just a bunch of killers in that gym. So yeah. you know he's going to be ready. Looks ready. Looks solid ready. Solid fighter. Yes, yeah. solid fighter. Over the top rope like a boss. He literally yeah. walked over the top rope. <laughs> I'm afraid to walk through the middle ropes. This guy's just yeah. walking over him like it's nothing. King Wisava, let's see if he's up. King Wisava. He's not even, he's like trying to get to the ring. People are telling him to go different ways. A little bit of ink on this gentleman. I yeah, like it. Sakyan style. My personal favorite. Oh, well, he's got a little bit of a mix here. Sakyan with Japanese, it looks like. Absolute killer in his own right, King. I'm pretty sure I called one of his fights on, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, in uh, Sukhumvit, the ambassador. Oh, Old Trinity. Uh, I think so, yeah. I miss those fights. That was a good venue for us. Outside. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, with COVID, it should actually be set. should actually do it again. Right? That's the, yeah. that's the place to do it. Limited audience. You get, yeah. and it's outside, but you have cover. You have cover, yeah. It's a great location. Slight height advantage, it looks like, there for King. The tie fighter with the height advantage over the white guy. Great ref, oh. doing a fantastic job today. Hairy guy though. <laughs> and he, clearly he has blonde hair. He's got this insane blonde hair growing off his arms. It's sort of an optical illusion when you see it in the light. Translucent. Yeah. We want to see how King is on the ground. Of course, Ty's new to the ground game. Indeed. Uh, relatively new in the last five years. Jack, of course, out of bar of course, probably trains on the ground quite often. So Just a little bit. Say, yeah. That's one thing I want to see here. The defense there from King. But of course, as a tie, solid kick, solid punches up top. He's using these four ounce gloves, so he has not got power. Here we go. Feeling each other out. Right. Little okay. leg kick to test the waters. Jack Ferguson in the blue. King in the with the red trim on his gloves. Okay. Takes him down. King on top of back, right back up. He's got that Muay Thai clinch. Solid. Oh, good take down. Oh, and a good spin. Almost a reversal. He's got to be careful. He's, he gives his back to Ferguson. Good, good luck. He looks like he's oh, trying to move into guard. Is that an elbow? I don't think. Can we throw elbows? Yeah, we can throw elbows. Throw elbows. Just no, six, no 12 to 6. Okay. Unified rules. Elbows allowed. So, so far, good defense from King. Yeah. That's oh. not a good takedown. Oh. I don't want to see that. Oh. 
leave himself susceptible to a knee as well. Tries to take him down, can't do it. Can't He's got him wrapped up, up though. Close guard, kind of out on the side a bit. Again, this is the problem with using the ring for MMA. But you work with what you got at these times. Okay. Uh-oh, posturing up now. Oh, he just lets him up. Wait. Yeah, it just lets nice. him up. Beautiful. They want to bang. Let's let him bang. Good left hand. King's throwing a bit wild here. High risk, high reward. We've got three and a half left here in round one. Jack is showing a lot of composure. Really, really measuring out. Oh, that nice jab. He just snuck it in there as King moved forward. Goes for a right good kick to the body, but he got caught with that. Another oh. takedown. In the side control now. I love, the the way, I love the way these takedowns sound in this ring. I will say that right now. They are thunderous. That goes here in the studio. Oh, oh it's locked in. I think he's got it. That it's is tight. so tight. He's oh, tapping. Oh, he taps. Whoa. Whoa. Two minutes into round one. Beautiful. Was it a head and arm triangle? Head, head and arm choke. Head and arm choke. Very tight. Very, very tight. Disappointment from King. Didn't see that coming. Solid, solid game plan there from Jack Ferguson. Another win there for Mario Force MMA. Beautiful. Second sub from that uh, from that camp today. Nick calls him into the center. Here we go. Get John Nutt will give us the winner. John Nup. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Core Combat Chiang Mai. Martial Arts. Fitness. MMA. Self-Defense. Kids Kickboxing. Now available with 3-month, 6-month and 12-month education visas. Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session. Core Combat Chiang Mai. Martial Arts for Modern Warriors.
Alive or dead, it's your choice. Chiang Mai, martial arts, fitness, MMA, self-defense, kids kickboxing. Now available with three-month, six-month, and twelve-month education visas. Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session. Core Combat Chiang Mai, martial arts for modern warriors. สดชื่นโพชั่นสปาร์กิ้งวิตามินกับ2รสชาติใหม่ศูนย์แคลไม่มีน้ำตาลอร่อยวิตามินบีสูงดื่มอร่อยเอนจอยกับชีวิตได้ทุกวันหาซื้อได้แล้ววันนี้ Drink Your Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Combat Chiang Mai, martial arts, fitness, MMA, self-defense, kids kickboxing. Now available with three-month, six-month, and twelve-month education visas. Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session. Core Combat Chiang Mai, martial arts for modern warriors. I saw it, did a 
never heard about A tall first hand, never word of mouth What's in the future for the fusion and the change Your rappers are in danger Who will you switch to be a remainder When the missile is aimed to blow you out of the frame Some will keep the limbs in Nothing but a half a mil we bill for. For real, y'all. Taking you on another one, son. Ocean Energy, a zero carry energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero carry energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online. Nothing but a half a mil we bill for. For real, y'all. Taking you on another one, son.
Core Combat Chiang Mai Martial Arts Fitness MMA Self Defense Kids Kickboxing Now available with 3 month, 6 month and 12 month education visas Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session Core Combat Chiang Mai Martial Arts for Modern Warriors Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Alive or dead, it's your choice. Combat Chiang Mai, Martial Arts, Fitness, MMA, Self Defense, Kids Kickboxing. Now available with 3 month, 6 month, and 12 month education visas. Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session. Core Combat Chiang Mai, Martial Arts for Modern Warriors. Alive or dead, it's your choice.
Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us on. Alive or dead, it's your choice. Teddy, co-main event. Are you ready for this? Yes, I am ready for this. This is going to be the first time that I see T.T. Denman just throw his hands. He was world famous from the fight circuit shows where he just annihilates in the kicking only. Oh, which, I, I love it. It was awesome. So the first fight, he or the first card, he annihilates his opponent. Yep. The second card, he injures his opponent, and he can't come out after round one. I mean, the kid's an absolute beast. <laughs> Here, here's the thing with this, Teddy. As a designer in my personal life, constraint is often a road to beauty. And I think that's what we see with T.T. Denham. Constraint in his tools is a road to beauty. Violent beauty. He's an absolute beast. He goes in there to kill 100%. And now he gets to showcase the world his hands. We already know what he can do with his legs. This is, I mean, I cannot, I, I, this is very exciting. Obviously the main event is gonna be just stylistically beautifully, yeah. but this one is what I personally am really, really looking forward to this. And like you said, we've never seen T.T. Dunham throw hands. He's done only kicks. Uh, yep. Apparently he's had four boxing fights previously some amateur boxing fights so he has been in there this isn't this not, not that i've ever seen but not that i've ever seen so and to me it, the world yep it's it's new it's novel but if you know anything about him or the, the denman camp no no joke but they're not giving him a lemon firm is a monster
Wonder Boy's uncle, the third man of the That's thing. right. Buckle in, folks. This is going to be a treat right now. What a great co-main event. We have Firm Chantala versus T.T. Denny. Three rounds, three minutes apiece. Don't blink. Both of these fighters are in it to win it. Skill set is here. Stamina is here. Everything you want. A touch of the gloves. Round one again. I'm Teddy Mulve alongside Dana Bluen. This is Potion Fight Night co Main event. Measuring each other now. Amateur my ass. Team. These guys both oh, look yeah. solid. See. Draws first blood. TT just waiting. He's so intelligent. A true martial artist, TT Den. Fight IQ through the roof. Oh, keep with the hands down. Be careful. Firm. Go ahead. Firm just looking great out there, looking smooth. And you know, confident. He's a great skill set. Ooh, good head movement there. Do you get that right slap from TT? You see him just slap away with the right and then come in with the left. Big body shot! Ticks underneath now up top, a little bit of a mad scramble. Good head movement by TT, grabs him up, says, and he says, you know what? I don't really like what you were doing there. Hugs him up, gets a separation, touches his hair as well, and TT back to one. So calm, both these guys just really Firm's doing gonna it. Get, he's gonna get the respect that he deserves. That little cocky smile from Firm. <laughs> I love it, I love it. Wow, he loved that. He's gonna be careful. Right now the head movement's there, but let's see if it's still there. Round two, round three, if he can matrix style his way out. Otherwise, TT's gonna sit him right down, I'm telling you. TT just looks like he's just being calm and yep. confident. Really just letting it in. I mean, he is calculating and downloading all the information, everything Firm's doing, the little moves and everything. He's, he's coming good right here. Another right hand, got him against the corner. Oh, mean mugs him right there. Oh, Ooh. big right hand with, and another one. TT now on the ropes and almost running away. Uh oh, firm now. Good shoulder roll. A little a la Mayweather there from TT. Such great defense. Mm -hmm. Very defensive fighter and willing to get in the pocket and be defensive. You don't often see that. The, the focus in TT's eyes. Good body shot again from Firm. He's got that distance down already, for sure, because of that pawing jab that he's throwing out. Well, clipped him on the head there now. Nice jab from TT. Center stage, both these fighters. We are in the belly of the beast of Bangkok, Thailand. The Big Mango. No better place to be for fight action. Greatest city on the planet. That potion fight night, man. They hit the ground running here in their first fight, their first ever show. Right there, first card ever. Love Imagine it, love this. It, love it. Of course, VP Nick Lee, man, thanks so much. Sexiest promoter in Asian MMA. Hands down, good. La right hand, excuse me, from TT in the southpaw. These guys, just so much fight IQ between the two of them. And these are amateur boxing matches. Ooh, tagged him. Ten seconds left. Oh, now he's going for it. Good left hand now. Finish strong. Uh, cl clinch oh, up. Oh, over right. the top. Clearly, we are about to see some fireworks in round two. That's a tough one to call for the judges. I mean, ring control and taking the fight to him was really firm. Absolutely, we saw some good defense. I mean, I don't. I would. I could not call that one. I, I, I would be leaning firm for sure. Okay. Now, but for me, though, the, the tough thing to judge here is how defensively smart TT yeah. was. How how are the judges going to see that? You have to wonder. Look how both of these guys so calm in the corner between rounds. TT takes the stool, Firm does not. Illy's just moving the hips around. Yep, staying loose. Getting his flow. Firm's corner asking for some head movement, just a little bit more head movement as he gets out of the combinations. When he gets in, throw it to the body, when he gets out, move the head. TT can definitely time and explode when he sees you. When he, when he gets you in his crosshairs, he does pull the trigger, so head movement short. I think they're going to turn it up in the second round. Here we go. Three three-minute rounds. Again, black trunks TT, red trunks firm. The big question is, how are the judges going to yeah. judge that defensive fighting style? They may not have to round two if he starts going full offense. Now he's waiting. Oh, he Good stepped left. in there. Yep. Good left. Sat down on that punch beautifully. Good body to shot the body. again. Probably about the third or fourth. Oh! Right hand lands. Caught him on the chin. Oh, and he got him again. Oh. Left hand from TT. 
and a smile. He loved it. He saw his work and he approved. Good smile there, but now he's back to work, T.T. Denman. Well, Firm is a strong-ass fighter. T.T. not rocked at all, not, not shaken to the body. Okay. Ooh, Ooh. T.T. goes from the body, couldn't land. Both fighters with the same idea. Yeah, let him play a bit. Frederick will let him play there, of course. Muay Thai is all of our, in all of our blood here down yeah. in Bangkok, so if they want to clinch, let him clinch a bit. No problem. Let them get to know each other. <laughs> yeah, get them dancing a bit, it's all right. TT's waiting. Firm just pawing. But see, Firm's not, not letting him. He's not yeah. playing TT's game. He's not just going to let him dictate what the fight is. So if he's not going to fight, then Firm won't either. Nice right hand. Beautiful. Backs TT up. Doesn't get too aggressive. Beautiful body shot does there. Does TT not blink? Yeah. <laughs> Neither does Firm. Eyes wide open for yeah. both these fighters. Good inside. Again, defense. Beautiful from TT. Love that Frederick's letting them tie up a bit yeah. here. Yeah, of course he will. Third man in the ring. Himself. Matchmaking here at Potion Fight Fight Night. Great. Off the chain. Is TT still just going to counter or is he going to try and mount some offense? I think what? TT's trying to draw for him into he throwing a body shot here so he can come across with that left. Because Firm, I mean, devastating with those body shots, but oh, good there, beautiful, just a left down the pike. Good head movement by Firm. Look at that defense again by TT. Just grabbed his arm, like grabbed his arm, made sure that left. It's that a right. millimeter out of oh, range. See, he, he, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, as I said, grabbed his arm, and then Frederick was like, "Yeah, stop doing that." Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> well, you ask for ask for forgiveness rather than permission. Eyes, uh, Uncle Wonder Boy. There you go. Go, get him with that left. You see him just get out of range of that oh, body shot? Good right hand again by Firm. Probably the strongest, uh, probably the strongest punches, most significant punches were Firm's to the body and then the two Absolutely. that he added up to the top. Yeah, though, this defensive style with only three rounds, I don't know how this plays with the judges. 10 seconds in round two. Before we get to our third and final round, good head movement by Firm, touch rock the body. Couldn't get that right over the top. Ten seconds left. You can't I mean, did you just go ten? No, I think Firm took it again. I, I think so, and I, I think I think Firm's up two rounds. I think this defensive style of TT is not going to do well over a three-round fight. This is a style you would you would implement in a, a much longer fight. Yeah, twelve-round boxing yeah. fight. Yeah, three, three rounds, rounds. You need yeah. to be more. Offensive, you need to be more aggressive. I'm looking at the corner of Firm. I feel like Firm knows he's up here. Of course, sure, sure, sure. At least he feels it, sure. And why wouldn't he? He's landed some big shots. Um, does TT understand that he's potentially down two rounds? I think Denman for sure knows it. He's right in his grill piece right now. Yeah. Letting him know. I think he might need, he needs a knockout or at least a knockdown. A knockdown to definitely tie it up, right? Two, tie it up, two, yeah. Two ten nines and you get a ten eight. Yeah. You know? He's got to at least sit him down. He, he's not, he's throwing enough power. He's not throwing the volume to get in there. Uh, here we go, third and final round of yeah. oh, this gorgeous cold main event. Ocean Fight Night, welcome to Bangkok and worldwide on the stream. I'm loving it, Dan. Big Mango, all day, every day. That's a nice there one. we go. That's a good connection. Oh, he's got a ball. Oh, now under right goes the again. Top. Oh, he is throwing it. Good shoulder roll, left by TT. Not much power behind it. While Firm is trying to put it away right now, he's trying to. Very evasive is TT yeah. with those incoming punches. He's just able to roll them off. But where's the offense, though? That's what we need to see. We this do need. Final rounds, 220 left. Firm again in control. That's a nice left. There we go. But oh, it's man. not enough. Yeah. It's not. Those rabbit punches are not going to win him that round. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here we go. Firm it, not running away from the fight either. No one oh. has two rounds. He's still in there. Good right hand over the top. Firm's controlling that distance a lot better. Pushes him to the corner. Yeah. He's going to go off. There we go. Oh. Big right hand pushes TT back. Oh, oh look at that. Back. Back. There he goes. Him. They're throwing. Tied up. Yeah. Frederick's letting him play a little bit. Of course. There we go. I love that. Really makes an exciting fight when you have Frederick in the ring. Absolutely. Fantastic ref. Who's that left? Okay, pawing at him now. Good left. Oh. Down the middle. Pop, pop from the small COVID crowd. Here's a pop slow there from the Denman fighter. Tied up a bit more. Yep. Oh. 
No action. So the pressure gets in there. Here we go. Here we go firm. He's not taking the bait for that body shot. He's just, nope. he knows what he's doing. He's confident. Here we go. Pushing him back to the corner again. Let's go. Let's go off now. There it is. Here we go. Right. Oh, TT being a little yeah. bit of cocky. As he always is. Ooh. But he backs it up. Now he's making him back away, but nothing there. Just a little bit to the yeah. side of the head. Is TT talking to him? I think they're talking trash. Trying to get him out. Get in his head. Okay, one minute left now. It seems as though Firm is on his way to take this amateur boxing bout in this co-main event. But, again, enough time for the explosive TT Denman. There he is, he's biting down on that gum shield. There he, goes. See he wants to, he knows he needs to finish this to get the W. Yeah, he is talking to him. And that's why you see a huge yeah, smile yeah. there from, from uh, Firm's loving from, it. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not, he's not getting in his head, he's feeding him. <laughs> Man, three rounds is not enough. It is and not. It's just not enough for these two. And for us. Oh! I'm loving this fight. So slick. 30 See, seconds. Now, now Firm, so intelligent. Now he's starting to run. Remember, I was yep. surprised in the beginning of the round that he wasn't. Ooh, big left. Oh, that connected. Now he's going to try and get yeah, yeah, shaking shake his head. Because TZ is just jarring at him right now. Here we go. The thing, TT knows he needs to finish, and Firm knows he has his fight won. Just 10 seconds left now. Good head movement. TT now. Now he's going for it. Where was this earlier? Yeah, we needed this in round one and two. Oh, he nails him! Go ahead, What a, a good finish, but not enough for TT. <laughs> you know what, though? He looked good in there, man. For someone who I only know as a kicker, yeah. uh, he, he looked slick in there. I really love that defense. I love the shoulder rolls. He had some great lefts. Yeah. But I mean, I was just going to say, oh, a little knot, a little knot. Oh, I see it, yeah. Uh, right there on the left side of his face. So TT did land strong. But I just think, I mean, right overall, overall, you got to give it a firm. Yeah. Just from punches landed, control of the ring, taking the fight to him. Yeah. I mean, great, great fight IQ for both of them. But I would yeah. love to see TT in a 12 round. Oh, man. That's, oh, my God. It was so dope. His style 12 yeah. rounds would be a fantastic fight. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. You know. Then there's a beginning, a middle, and an end to it. Here, it's just we just, just got a taste. John, not collecting the scores. Yeah. Judges, scorecards, four decisions. Stay tuned. The ladies are up next, and what will be Ooh. a super. I got chills. I got chills. Super skillful match. Marie Rumet and Poe Denman. But it looks like Denman Camp will not take this one. We're going to give it to the big man, John Nutt. The man, the myth, the legend. Yeah. Because there are so many things that I watch as a fan who are not watching as a judge. So yeah. there are these little intricacies that these judges see, and that is why they're there, and that's why I'm sitting here. Absolutely. I, having judged a lot of fights in my time. Wow, TT Denman takes it. Congratulations. Wow. Energy, a zero carry energy drink full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero carry energy drink full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion.
Accuracy, accuracy, accuracy. She is a sniper. Also, incredible head movement. And she is yeah. one of the fighters who is tall and long and fights. Incredible tall range. And long. Absolutely. You're right. She uses it. Yeah, all the she time. uses Constantly. that range to her advantage. Yep. And I think that's her key to victory here against Marie. Marie, Mar very, very well rounded fighter. Very experienced. Yep. Now, yeah. this is just boxing, five three minute rounds yep. of only boxing. Marie is a Muay Thai specialist, so here, no knees, no kicks, no elbows, it's just gonna be hands flying, which I, I, I think gives Poe the advantage for her being so tall and long, but do not count out Marie. Marie has hands. fast hands. Yes. And there's Denman right there, that's Peter Denman walking in there, that is his camp. Absolutely, great shirt on Peter Denman, love it. And there she is, Marie Rumet. Fighting out of Yorkie MMA right now. This is her first ever boxing fight. She does have a ton of fights in other disciplines, but again here trying it. True martial artists, these two girls. Modern day gladiators, I like to say. Yep. Neither, again, oh, again neither I'm Teddy Mulvey alongside Dana Blue and follow me on Instagram, Teddy M U L V A G H. Thanks. Follow me nowhere, you stalkers, but <laughs> at Dana Blue and everywhere. So the, the thing I love about this fight, too, with Marie and Poe is that they have so much experience. Neither of them are going to be gun shy, and neither of them are afraid to get hit. At all. We've both seen Poe fight that way. Yes. Head butts, Head bare butts. knuckles. Yeah, yeah. She, you're, with, with these gloves on, she's not afraid to get hit. She's taking bare knuckles to the face. She's not afraid to get hit with a boxing glove. Same with Marie. Marie is not afraid to get in the pocket and trade. It's a little weird that she's just height? coming in. Yeah, on the same side. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Considerable big, size yeah, advantage, advantage for Poe overall. So apparently there was some confusion as to the weight. Old. She has been fighting for six years, which means she has started fighting since she was 15 from Estonia. At one point, she was living in a tent at Team Quest Thailand up in Chiang Mai, <laughs> training and fighting every day. I mean, just a true martial artist, and this is why these two women are top bill for Potion Fight Night. Nick Chapman is the third man in the ring. Yesterday at weigh-ins, Poe was three and a half kilos heavier than Marie. Considerable size advantage at this weight. Here we go. Females taking center stage. That's like five, three minute rounds. No nerves here. They're not rushing into it, feeling each other out. Let's see if Poe can use that range to her advantage. Oh, my hand. Right off the bat, keeping her on the outside. Yeah. Marie is dangerous if she gets in the pocket and can unload with those hands. 
where he went down to the belly and then got out of the way from that jab. Oh, which is surprising how fast she got in and out. Her speed oh, is going to be... Oh, just the end of this. Marie's speed is going to be a big yeah. weapon for her here. She's got great feet. Oh, good left hand there. I should fall up that right. You see her close that distance so quick. Come in on the outside even. Seems like she's not wasting any movement at all either. Which does something that's a lot of purpose. Boy, God damn jab. Look at the head move. Paul. We knew this was going to happen. And still, it's beauty. Every time. And Down she's, low. look at her land to the body with that range. Those long arms of hers. Good circle to the left as well, Paul. I would argue these are probably the best two female fighters in Thailand right now. Yeah, sure. And they're, yeah. they're main eventing the first ever card for Potion Fight Night. It's awesome. And they deserve, absolutely deserve it. Nice left from Marie. Marie's getting in that pocket and landing. I am so impressed. Expect nothing less from these professionals. Absolutely. She's backing her up now. Where's Poe going to go? She spins away and then lands a right. Pop from the crowd. This is why these are the top two females in Thailand. Absolutely fantastic. Look at that distance. Good laugh. Counter though by Poe. Poe's making her pay for closing that distance. Nice left again. How amazing. Poe is so long, but she can still get those shots in, in the pocket with those hooks. Wow, she tested the waters with that big right Marie, didn't she? Yeah. She didn't throw a lot of power around it. She tested it. We might see that in the, in the upcoming rounds. A huge right off I the top. I hope we do. Yeah. Oh, wow, she's got Poe in the corner. Let's go. Circling out. Yeah, her footwork is just so amazing. That left. Oh, 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 there's that head movement. Perfect head movement for yep. Poe, but we know we're going to see that. Marie has zero fear of getting in that pocket and trading with Poe. No she's had, she's taken huge damage before. She's been bloody up in fights. She has no problem with it, Marie. Bo both these girls are not afraid to take damage. We've seen it before from both of them. Poe's landing. Oh, I think I just saw a cheeky look to Poe's corner. I think I just saw a cheeky look to Denman. Really? That's how good of a student she is of the game. Constantly learning and evolving. Oh, I cameraman. Settle down. Yeah. Settle down, buddy. <laughs> nice. It's a great nice fight, but we need you to be calm. Nice right hand at the end by, uh, by Poe. That first round is everything I want to see for this fight. Okay, Poe with her great, great use of range, keeping Marie on the outside, and Marie willing to come into the pocket and trade with Poe. What I love is I can see Poe, even though she has that range and she can get that jab out there, she's still able to use those hooks yeah. inside in the pocket and, and give some damage to Marie, make her pay for coming into the pocket every, to exchange. Every time she's making her pay as well. Yeah. That left, beautiful. Instead of coming straight with the jab, she's throwing it around yes. with that hook, and it's lovely. The footwork and speed of Marie is what I'm, I'm really impressed with here, that she closes the distance so quick and is getting damage done on the outside. But if Poe's going to keep circling to her left, she has to be worried about Marie, or at least be aware that Marie's going to throw that right. Yeah. Because that's all she's been doing, circling left, circling left. And I saw Marie test that right. Of course, she didn't want to throw it so early in the fight. But if she lands with that, that's going to change the entire fight. So let's see how Poe, you know, uh, what do I want to say, gets out of danger. Is she going to keep circling left? I would love to know what Peter told her between rounds. I wish we had a microphone. This is so good. Here we go. Round two, main event. Marie in the black and red. Great exchange. Black. This is for all the marbles. The Super Flyweight Championship Potion Fight Night. Thanks for joining us worldwide on the live stream. There's that black. Oh, that man, that's what I want right. to see. Come on. Oh, Marie goes oh. down low and then up top with a left. So fast. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh. right around the corner. But he's still circling the left. Still yeah. Circling the left. Punch the body and then in and out. That footwork of Marie is so cool. And back down low. She's coming in, doing damage, and she's getting out when she can. And she's doing something you rarely see. And she's making Poe miss. Yeah. And that is not something you see quite often. Her oh. footwork and her speed is really mitigating Poe's range. Ooh. I love that. She just decided 
to put her head down and film a couple haymakers makers because you gotta, you can't stick to the same game plan. Denman Camp is gonna read you. So you know what? Throw something in there a little weird. Change it up? Yeah! Make him question. Awesome. Oh, it's super relaxed. Yeah. She is just, it's like she's born to be in that ring. While Maria just stalking. There it is. There it is. Poe's doing a great job on the ropes, getting out of range there. Leaning back. Ooh, oh, no, that one! Not with that one, yeah. yeah. See, see, she's getting, she's getting tagged. She's got to be careful. Nice, right? Watch it, watch it. She might need her hands up here now with someone like Marie. Poe's planting her feet a bit too much for fighting someone like Marie here. I love that wow. when she falls into that left. Wow, Poe just happy to be on the ropes. Yeah. Happy to be measuring. Happy to be reading her opponent. She's got to get a little lighter on the feet, though. Someone like Marie who can just walk in and start landing punches like that. We see her closing the distance, yeah. getting in the pocket. That's Tony's needs nice. to do a little bit something more here. Nice three-piece combo by Marie. Going down low again. Wow, she changes levels effortlessly, Marie. Ooh. Yeah. Poe was looking for a straight right. A little Didn't aggressive. There it comes. Uh oh, a little bit of a scramble there. Poe's gotta watch that deep. She gotta keep her gloves up. Yeah. Marie's gonna make her pay. She needs a little bit more defense that, that we saw from yeah. uh, in the previous fight from uh, TT. Oh! Lands a vicious right, falls and up with a left. That's some sick ass power right there. From yeah. Her. And then in and out, slick in and out. Marie standing strong. Oh, there we go. Not backing down. Neither one of these women. Marie going to the body quite a bit. Well, taller fighter, right? Why not? And that head is so hard to hit for Poe because she's so slick with her movements. Ten seconds left in round two. One. She's getting to the body. She's doing damage. Yes, They're landing she is. good. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, there it is again. She <laughs> wow. So, I mean, that's Marie's round, no? Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. Uh, no question. Mar Marie dominated that round. And her game plan is clearly picking apart Poe here. Wow. She's making Poe miss, and she's getting in the pocket, and she's able to trade effortlessly. Wow. I, I really would love to know what Peter's telling Poe in the corner here. She still seems really round, I can't believe that round just went by that fast. Was that a one-minute round? 30 I seconds. I mean, wow, what a fight. What a card. What yeah. a fight. Man, we saw stoppages, we saw TKOs, submissions, and now to cap it all off with a beautiful super flyweight championship. My God. And also, hey, first time calling a fight with you, let me just take the minute. Hey, awesome. Thank you, man. I appreciate I'm having a great time yeah, awesome, calling with you. Okay. Oh, wow. I'm not going to chill. I know, I know. I'm okay, okay, for this okay. third round. So here we go. I mean, if, if it's going to be a five-round fight, I'm going to use my Muay Thai uh, 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 verbiage here. It is the money round right Absolutely. now. This is it. This is when it really it really starts to open up for these fighters. And, you know, it's tie back rounds that these fighters have. This is truly a money round, especially for Marie. Now, if Poe can make some adjustments here and stop the... Stop what Marie was doing last round to take advantage of getting in the pocket there. Then she might be able to turn it around. Otherwise, yeah. I think we're going to see more of the same. She can catch her with an uppercut if, if Marie ducks her head down. She can catch her with an uppercut. Wow, Marie now with the distance. Yeah. Wow. Just such experience for Marie. I, I think that's the, the factor here that's yeah. really changing things up. At 21 years old, she has so much experience in the fight game. And that fight IQ is coming through. Wow, Poe chasing now a little bit. First time we've seen that here. Yeah. Bit of a change in style for her. Wait, Marie is making her miss. Yeah, so weird. Goes to the body again. The, That's how, there we go, Poe. The fighter with less reach coming in from the outside is landing to the body yep. consistently and hard. Good left there from Poe. Just off the gloves, though. Marie now letting it rip. Grabs her. Oh, is Poe hurt? Yeah, I saw her stumble at the end of round two. That's when I just was, I, I, but then she, she recovered, so I didn't say anything. She does seem at least flustered at this point. She looks like she's guarding her, her midsection a bit. Ooh, left for Marie! Oh! Yeah, do you think that's what her right hand, her, her right is guarding? Yeah. Oh, she's going yeah, you see, she, yeah, she's backing up when she takes that, that midsection shot. A lot of work for Poe's left hand. Oh, it's up the right hand, beautiful. The speed on Marie is not slowing down. No, no, no. Third round, 
she's faster than she was in the first. Yeah. I told you that's why it's the money round. It's a classic Muay Thai to, to turn it up in round three and four. Good oh. left hand after going to the body. When Poe drops her hands, nice right hand there from Poe. Strong now, stepping into it, really sitting into those punches. Marie with a one-two, missed on the on the two, but got that one. Marie just stalking. Down low on top, beautiful left again. Down to the body, beautiful by Poe there. Makes her miss. Mad scramble. Okay. I thought that oh. Marie was gonna struggle with that range, and she has not struggled not at all. At all. Not it's at not all. even a factor. Poe's trying to slow her down. A good one too. Bull rushes Poe. That's exactly what she has to do with a great green plan from the Yorkie Gym. Just get right in her face, making her miss again. I don't think Marie has ever fought a fighter with this much range. It, it's not even an issue for her. That's her fight IQ is through the roof here. At 21 years old, six years of experience. <laughs> Poe staying active, which she needs to be. Good right. Now let's power on it. 10 seconds. Oh, 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 oh. That's back it up. See how she finishes it. Three, two, oh. good right hand from Paul oh. Strong. Oh. Wow. Wow. Money, money round coming up next. And okay, listen, we had the, the, the co main event, we had dead wrong. Yeah. So I'm just going to say what I think. But I think Marie is completely in the driver's seat, to tell you the truth. Not like she's beating, like beating her up bad or anything, but she's connecting more. She's dictating the fight. It seems like she's fighting her fight. Well, normally we see Poe fighting her fight, fighting the Poe's fight. Yes. Poe is now fighting Marie's fight. She needs to take back control. Somehow she needs to take back control. Now, I don't know how she does it at this point. Marie is dominating in every range of this combat. Right? She's out on the outside. Marie's able to get in close. She's able to land to the body at will. She's landing to the head at will. She seems to have no issues whatsoever here. And I like, I like when she, I, I, I like when, when she gets close. Sometimes she just lets it fly, like almost like puts her head down and just goes. And they're connecting. Yes. And it's throwing Poe off. I've never seen Poe struggle with an opponent like this. Nope. But do not count out Poe or the Deadman camp. The money, money round right now of our main event. And Poe knows she needs to take this. Oh, that's a nice right hand. Poe being more aggressive here yes. in the fourth. Step into those punches. Take the fight to her. The go. speed of Marie go. is just a fourth round. In, I can't believe we're four rounds into this, first of all. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's just, yeah. Marie is as yeah. fast, if not faster, than she was in rounds one, two, and three. So light on her feet. Yeah, effort, effortless, though, if you will. Poe wow, is a bit flat-footed. She's stalking her down now. There's that oh. right. She snapped the head of Poe back. Poe has nowhere to go. Oh, good to the body, and again makes Poe miss three in a row. My God. Poe is just a little flat-footed here. Yeah. A little, little bit of uh, exchange on the break there. Yeah. <laughs> wow, punches and bunches from Marie. Great combinations. There's like a beginning and a middle and an end to what she's doing here. Every time she steps in. Tries to go over the top. Just a swing and a miss. That has landed rounds one and two. That was nice. That one just missed. There she comes again. Watch the right. There it comes. Poe. Poe is just struggling yeah. with this speed. Yep. And the fact that she's missing. If yeah. she's landing some of these, obviously it's a different fight. But the fact, there, there it is again. The fact that she's missing. And when she's missing, Marie's getting closer and hitting and landing. And Marie is, I thought she was going to have trouble closing that distance because of the range. And not even, not so even fast, not it's even not even a factor. Yeah. And there it is. Poe now taking the fight to her lands a right hand. We saw Poe landing in the Ooh. pocket with those hooks in the first round. Marie has figured out a solution to that puzzle, and it's not even a factor at this point. Oh, good right hand! Oh, oh, I think she rocked Poe a little bit. Yes. You see a little bit of a wobble. Oh, oh, oh no, no, backing no. her up! Oh, she's Did going she... for it now! Can she put her out with oh. three seconds left? Marie's going to keep this pressure on. She can get the stoppage. <laughs> yeah. Back to Poe's, the body. Poe's in trouble. Poe's in trouble. Little shaky on the legs there. Marie sees it too. Uh oh, oh, yeah, she knew the break was coming. She's got to be careful. She can't break on her own. Poe's going to make her pay for that. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, right up to oh, 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 my God. God. A five-piece combo. Poe on the back heels. Mouth open. Marie going for the kill. Pushes her against the ropes. What a fight. 
Oh, what a main event! 20 seconds left in the money, money round! Oh! Snap the head back! Hole forward, wobbly on her feet, falling backwards. Marie sees it, chases her down. Get the Go break, 30 kill. seconds left! My lord! Down to the body! Man, she is not letting oh. up at all. Nice one, two up top. Break oh. Wow! Wow! Wow, Teddy! Oh my god! Marie! Wow! Not even sitting down! My she, lord! She's too hyped up after yeah, the coach has to get, push her into the get, stool! She's gotta get her hair here. Oh she's my god! get that hair tangled. Here we go. But she's not even flustered. Oh she's not even tired. Pro Talk looking. about flustered and tired, though. That yeah. is the blue corner. Head down. Deep, deep breaths from Poe. And the fact that she doesn't have, we talked about how slick she is with boxing. We talked about punches and bunches, but yeah, the eye, I saw it. But um, she doesn't have, really have knockout power. And especially the fact that Marie's not hurt. I mean, she's breathing tired, but she's not dead tired. Yeah. So I do not see a knockout coming. So even if she wins this round, I don't think it's going to be enough to win the fight. Yeah. But we were, we were dead wrong. wrong. Dead wrong. Dead wrong. Dead wrong. Dead wrong. Dead wrong. What an exciting fight. Who man. knows how the judges are going to see this, but for me right yeah. now, Marie is oh, dominant. She looks great. All due respect. Here we go. Fifth and final round. Five rounds. Oh, right away to the body. This is the main event potion fight night. Thanks for joining us worldwide on the screen. Again, I'm Teddy Bobby. That's Dana Blue, and here we go. And we are honored to be calling this fight for you guys today. Absolutely. Marie has been dominant for... Can you believe five Four. rounds? Yeah, now already around round five. And Marie, oh, do you think she's going to take her foot off the gas? No, absolutely Hell not. Bro, Poe's just whipping that out there now. She's exhausted. Hands real low. See where the gloves are from each fighter. I love that scramble. I love the way Marie handles that tight, that, that distance there. There it is. Whoa! Oh. And she steps to the left and throws that hook. To the body back up. She's now, mixing it up so see, well, Teddy. Now you see Poe start dancing on her feet, but where was that round two? Where was that round three? I, like you were saying, yeah, super flat footed. She was planting yeah. herself there and it, just, it wasn't working, and now it's now too did. late. Yeah, now she's getting stalked. Good right hand, and then to the body. She knew. Oh, 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 she oh, oh. Another left up top. They tie up. Poe exhausted. exhausted. She's been getting beat up. See, when Poe moves her head like that, Marie's intelligent enough to go to the body. See, there she went up top, she missed. But that's why she's working the body. She knows she can't get the head. Well, fine, you're gonna give me your stomach? I'll take it. There's a mad scramble again as she connects on most of her shots. Marie looking gorgeous in the ring right now. This Not is stopping fight. at all. This is her first boxing fight, a Muay Thai specialist, and now look how great she looks. My God, against a, against a defendant, great opponent in Paul. Wow. To think that her fight IQ is translating so well from Muay Thai MMA to boxing. <laughs> Has to has to tie it up here just to get some reprieve. Oh my gosh, she can't even lift her gloves up. Oh, oh yeah. one, two, oh, oh, no, the body. in the corner. Marie is punishing. 45 here. seconds left. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, keep Nick, Nick is no, asking no, her if she no. still wants to go. No quitting, Paul Denman. No quitting. Oh my god. Nick taking a very close look at Poe every yeah. time he's breaking it here. Oh, he might give her a standing eight, maybe. All right, Poe's on the defensive now. Real on the defensive now. My God. Poe po is running on empty, but there this is no quit in her. Awesome. Grimacing in the corner here against the ropes. Marie, Again. the volume and speed of Marie at the end of the fifth round. Ten seconds left. Fifteen minutes into this fight, and oh. she's still oh. strong. Every shot. Two-piece up top. Wow! wow. What, what a main event! That is the type of fight you want to see, man! Oh my god! Marie Roumette in the blue corner, Poe Denman in the red. This is for all the marbles. Super Flyweight Championship. We go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. Do not listen to what I think. Or me. <laughs> but, but I think clearly 
I mean, Marie just just got it done. I would find it hard to believe if Marie did not win that on oh all, every judge's scorecard. But I have been wrong in the yeah. past. I could give very that. recently. Could have given whole round one. Maybe I, I would have <sighs> done that. That would have been all right. I could see that happening. But I mean, no. definitely the money round, money, money round, and the final round. Get out of here. Come I, on. I was blown Stop away it. by how Marie mitigated every single one of Poe's tools. She must have been, either her or her camp, must have been all night on footage just watching Poe because she knew exactly what Poe was going to do. Yeah. It was oh, in Tech Mobile when you picked the same play. Here we go. So we have a oh, great girl finally. coming. Oh, Okay. We were wondering why yeah. this gorgeous woman, woman was sitting in the back. We were like, what's this chick doing here? I, this is it. She's the belt I, presenter. Th maybe she oh. had an accident with her motorbike on the oh. way in. Like, see, she got some rips on the fishnets. I, a poor girl. I hope she's okay. Wait, is that, is that, is that on purpose? <laughs> is that on purpose? Anyways. <laughs> Johnny Nut. Leave it to Johnny Nut for the decision. Surprise. Wow, what a great fight. What a great card. I mean, and, and especially during these times right now, to see boxing and MMA uh, on display here. Of course, Bangkok's going to have it. And there she is. The spoils go to the winner. And her first ever boxing fight. I mean, beautiful. First Absolutely boxing fight wins the championship. Wins yeah. Not against an easy opponent. At all. Wow. Well, thanks for joining us. I'm going to give it to the people in the ring to say goodbye. Uh, for Dana Bolin, I'm Teddy Mulvey. As far as the commentary team, thanks for joining us. We're out. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Potion Energy, a zero calorie energy drink, full of vitamin B, taurine, and much more. To order, add us online at Potion Drink. Drink your potion. Core Combat Chiang Mai, Martial Arts, Fitness, MMA, Self-Defense, Kids Kickboxing. Now available with 3-month, 6-month and 12-month education visas. Contact us today for your free consultation and to claim your free first training session. Core Combat Chiang Mai, Martial Arts for Modern Warriors.
ซ่าสดชื่นโพชั่นสปาร์คกิ้งวิตามินกับ2รสชาติใหม่ศูนย์แคลไม่มีน้ำตาลอร่อยวิตามินบีสูงดื่มอร่อยเอนจอยกับชีวิตได้ทุกวันหาซื้อได้แล้ววันนี้ Drink y o u